Hi, my name is Dean Neary. I'm an associate professor and chair of the physical medicine department here at uh, Bastyr University School of Naturopathic Medicine. I have been using the Microlite uh, ML830 laser for about eight years now, uh, primarily at our teaching clinic uh, in Seattle, as well as some experience in my private practice here locally. Uh, what can I say about the laser? Uh, over the years, uh, I will admit I've been a skeptic, a bit of a skeptic of low-level laser therapy. Uh, I can say that as of late, I think I've changed my tune. I've become a believer, so to speak. Um, I've seen a lot of objective improvement in patients' uh, conditions over the years, uh, treating a variety of things from wound care to uh, countless myofascial uh, injuries and conditions, fibromyalgia, um, trigger point therapy, strain sprains, uh, etc. Uh, numerous patients that I could allude to. One that always kind of sticks in my mind as being kind of a, a turning point moment for me and my experience with the laser was a young man, 23 year old gentleman who came in, had an on the job accident, got into a bit of a tussle with a uh, circular saw and tried to uh, cut off his second digit on his right hand. He came to us uh, post-operatively after the finger had been repaired, came to us for kind of post post-surgical care and sort of a PT approach, wanted to maintain mobility and uh, help to heal the, the lesion. A colleague of mine saw him, uh, prescribed low-level laser therapy, a uh, course of treatments of which I saw him on probably about treatment number three, and he came in, and he alluded to the fact that he thought if he was a doctor, he would change where we were doing the treatment. And I asked him why, and he said, well, the past couple of visits, you've been treating my hand on the, on the bottom side here with the laser and not on the top side. And if it, if it were him, he would treat the top side. And I said, why? And when he showed me his hand, the uh, laceration on the bottom of his hand where the laser had been used was significantly well healed in, in comparison to the upper side of his hand where we had not done treatment. Uh, and so obviously at that point we changed treatment protocol to begin treating that top part. And he had one concern, which I found kind of humorous in that he said, uh, please don't treat it too much because he didn't want the scar tissue to completely go away so that he would have this battle scar to show off. So uh, pretty convinced the laser was playing a significant role in his healing. Um, as I said, I've had eight years of experience, uh, probably thousands of actual patient visits to our teaching center uh, between myself and my colleagues. Many, many, many favorable outcomes uh, to the extent that most patients come in now and they're re-injured themselves, come in and specifically ask for the laser, uh, don't even want anything else, they want just the laser done. So I'm pretty convinced at this point in time that the laser therapy is uh, genuine, is effective, is a wonderful treatment tool, it's inexpensive, it's quick, uh, patients love it. I can't really say enough good about it at this point. Uh, I'm a convert, a believer, and plan on using the laser for many years to come. Thank you.